cider. It's a drink crafted around the world, wherever apples and pears are grown. So what makes Australian craft cider unique? Well, it's the place for a start, this place, Australia. Every autumn across this great southern land, hundreds of people are busy crushing fruit and fermenting juice to make cider. From the orchards around Sydney, where Granny Smith nurtured a chance apple seedling in the 1860s, to orchards in Western Australia, where the Pink Lady apple was bred a century later. From orchards in the rugged high country of central Victoria, first established in the Gold Rush, to orchards on the cool island of Tasmania, first planted in 1788. Then there's the people. Some of Australia's cider makers have been growing apples and pears here for generations. But most of them are newcomers. Brewers, winemakers and entrepreneurs who fell in love with cider and started making their own. Together, this country's wide craft community produces a huge diversity of ciders. They are respectful of old world cider making traditions, but are not held back by them and they are keen to explore new techniques and experiment with new flavours. And then of course, there's the passion. Some of us like to get fancy with our cider, arguing the merits of one apple over another, carefully matching different styles of cider to different foods. But most of us just like to drink it. 